All right, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. We are going to go meet Natty Onai in Lower Hogsfield. So let's cue up the music and then we'll go see what she wants. So this is going to be our first time <coughs> wandering out to a hamlet that I know of. We may have accidentally got to one I've always here or there. Sure, but, uh, the yes, it does. But we're going to take the long way. We're going to walk in. We've been Revelion and learned how to use that spell a little bit better. So that we actually uh, can track down these missing pages and all that using our wand and our sense of hearing, which is kind of cool. Still getting to know my way around here. Revelio. bell somewhere around here but it's so distant I don't even want to bother right now let's stick to the plan mm -hmm. it's so easy to get distracted in this game I'll tell you there's so much going on good lord I'm gonna need to stop for a glass of water before I even get out of here that was a long loading screen all right Cool, looks like morning's coming. We haven't been to bed yet. We stayed up all night doing things we shouldn't do. We were out killing guys. We were setting cats on fire. Yeah, we were just doing all kinds of awful stuff. But it was kind of fun. I can't believe you could singe a cat. Oh, the beast's classroom. Alright, well, we'll be coming there soon, I'm sure. kind of anxious to get a little bit more of the story done so that um, I can go ahead and get my broom and start brewing potions, uh, start growing things and working on my room of requirement. That I'm excited for. I've always enjoyed like the home base building aspect of certain games. Sometimes they do it really, really well. It's going to be a win. Alright. There we go. But yeah, we're collecting a ton of Moonstone, though, boy. I'll tell you that. Revelio. It's kind of nice. Almost expect a troll under the bridge. Well, it looks like we're getting fairly close to the hamlet. Hogsfield. So we got Hogwarts, Hogsmeade, Hogsfield. Where's Hogfarts? Here's another thing here. This one's already activated. Oh, we've been out this way. Okay, there's that long bridge. Now again, we may have already visited this hamlet. I don't think so, but Rebellio. it's hard to say. Hey there. There you go. Woohoo! This looks intriguing. Okay. Sorry. Well, this, this place? Yeah, let's check it out. Why not? Oh, see? Field guide page, ground keepers, tools. Oh, so this is what's his name's place? Um, or no, it's not. Is it? We are 
close. Revelia. This girl's got a thing for me, so I'm gonna have to keep her at bay. Let's see what's going on out here, though. Can I beseech you for some assistance? Sure, Grace Pinch. Hello, Smedley. Can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes, my name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. Of course. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? <laughs> I'm afraid I'm that not keen on mucking like about at the bottom of lakes. Oh, please don't say no just yet. Perhaps if you understood my plight, you'd change your mind. Perhaps. What precisely do you need to retrieve and why? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrally vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. <sighs> Let's see. Hmm. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand, but I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Anything else you found would be all yours. Mm -hmm. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. I do hope you find the astrolabe. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Oh, why not? We'll take a quick dive. How do I go under? Revelio. No path available. I don't think we can dive though. Now I'm regretting getting rid of the minimap. Rebellion. Look at the way he's walking. <laughs> Can't cast the spell while we're doing the swim thing. Uh, screw this, we're not getting it right now. Get my nice dragon jacket all wet. Come on, lady. Ooh, there's a cave. See, I'm supposed to go meet that girl, and you screwed me up. Now I gotta grab leeches. And whatever this is. What is that? Why do I feel like... Why do I feel like the are top of there? Yeah, no? Revelio.
All right. See, we're getting distracted again. Oh, Lord Almighty. Let's get a move on. else over there. Okay, we got to get back to the quest log, though. So, eh. There we go. And we can get those quests started up and active and just go... Oh, there she is. Go visit them later. I'll try past her. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Yeah. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. A bit odd. The two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and okay. Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Rookwood and Harlow <coughs> are a dangerous pair on their own. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Fair enough. I will. So we got another little mission Rebellion. over here. What's going on here? I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Pardon me, on, is everything bud? all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ranrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ranrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. <laughs> I wish it had Fair been enough. under better circumstances. All right, well, this one we're going to try, and now look at this. we got a guy we can buy from over here. So let's check our inventory real quick and make sure that we are 
geared up to top specs here. Okay, so those are no better. And that is locked away. Level 14, but it will be a slight upgrade. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. What do you have for sale? All right. What can I help you with today? Let's get right to it, bud. All of this is easy to find. That's kind of nice, but we're not wasting the money on it. And this... We will sell that. I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. But yeah, we've got three things locked away based sometime. on our level. Cool. Revelio. You probably well, will. After what Ranrock did to that goblin Lots banker of, of Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what Swipe happened to him. Swipe around here. That's a nice big chest. Time to argue. I told you repeatedly not to stray far from home, especially Rebellion. when you're your little sister. But you should see them, Mummy. They're beautiful. These horses with wings. Oh, that's enough. I'm too tired for your stories today. That's you weird. stay right here where I can see you. Now, why don't you do some more drawings for me? Hmm? Very well, Mummy. It's got a lock on it. Alright. We were heading to a camp, if I remember correctly, right? Yep, let's go. Hmm. Something. Incendio. Okay, that was a spider. Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. Ah. Eight lights is right, simply done too. too many. That's just utterly nasty. <laughs> I do not like spiders. Some Miranda walking along. Incendio. Yep. Grab a little moon rock while we're at the top. There's some more. Revelio. Levioso. Oh, you're big. Incendio. Whoops, missed. Probably a good thing. It probably kicked me. Revelio. There's something here. Beasts welcome. Nothing else around here, though. Oh, wow. Now that's cool looking. Now we need to get ourselves back on track. Way too distracted. Revelio. As we wander off again. puzzles. Alright. I don't think we have the means to do those yet.
but I'm sure we'll get there. Man, how far did these guys go? Incendio. Bye, nasty Past spider. The ruins. I'm on the right track. I'll take your fang. Spiders so far aren't nearly Rebellion. as horrible as I thought they would be. Signpost here. Feldcroft. Keen Bridge. Okay. There's another location over there. The balloons that. everywhere are cool. This must be it. Toast quick. Rebellion. Levioso. Accurate. How many of you are there? Shut Yeah, someone's here. Stupid to come here. Let me open. Avenge your death. Hello? Let me open. Assassin. See you over there. Something. 
Now, to free Arn's cards. Revelio. Well, this is kind of a cool place. Kicked a bunch of goblin ass. <laughs> Did I say goblin ass? That doesn't sound so good. Alright. <laughs> Levioso! Oh, so cool. So what do we do here? Can't Levioso though. Can't Levioso. Can't Levioso. Can't Levioso. There's anything we can do with that right now. Where's the carts? Oh, the carts are in here. Quite an enchantment. Look at that. The carts are returning to on. Rebellion. What are those things? What is this? There's some right here too. That oh, wigan well potion, okay? Ah, look at that. Cool. <laughs> there we go. Get it out of the way. More spectacles. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Get a bunch of these guys. Levioso. Oh, I wonder. Levioso. Check it out. That's cool. Okay. That was cool. Revelio. Yeah, I don't really know if there's much else we can do from here. Is that still just hanging there? It is. Levioso! I bet you that explodes. Oh, we got something up there we can get. May as well clear out everything we can. Diamond Debonair Ensemble. Not a lot of these things are better than what we've got. But, screw it, at least we'll be able to sell them. I honestly don't know what to do with those things. Accio. I'm not really getting anywhere with that. Can't react with the machine at all. Maybe we need a different spell to get here to do that. I don't know. We'll have to come back. Check it out at a later date. But for now, we're going to go back and visit our buddy there, Mr. Goblin. See what kind of, excuse me, kind of reward he'll offer us for uh, helping him out there. It looks like he might have a store from what he said, so that would be kind of cool. With the other guy there, we'll have two little stores we can shop from in that spot. I know we could fast travel back, but... Accio. 
and send it. Ugh. Shame you're so spiders? foul. And they are nasty. Pretty good design on them. Ugh. Foul is the absolute right word, my friend. Coins on the road. And we're back here at the dead dragon. He's a little fella. And the game looks great. Absolutely beautiful. Hello. I wonder if random creatures like that will get attacked by spiders and stuff. I do enjoy games where the uh, various creatures will sometimes fight with each other or factions of enemies. That's always kind of cool. Got a minute. We're just going to run up here. Got lots and lots of mushrooms and oh okay something going on down there let's go talk to our buddy oh. oof if you're here for my wares on I have good friend. news your cards are on their way back <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what to say any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. The ones I faced were determined to make things difficult. Well, it was difficult. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. I'm not sure that's worthy of a painting. Yeah. You'd be surprised at how art can touch people. I think it's well worthy. Thank you again for all of your help. You got it. All the best to you. Once my car goblin arrived, made helmet. I'm going to show you my wares. We hit level 14. Oh, we're like a hair away from it, aren't we? Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yeah, we are a hair away from it. Alright, let's see if we got anything better. 31. Yeah, we'll take that. I hate that look, though. I wish the transmog would automatically pass over. That would make things a little nicer. And again, we're just going to be trading gear for a long time now, so I'm really not concerned about anything other than raw offense and defense. It's probably a nice looking setup. Let's see that diamond debonair. There it is. Kind of looks good with this outfit. All right. I know it's a game, not a fashion show. Revelio. Right, so we got those guys over there. Trudging through the water again. I don't remember if we got this bag or not. Can't imagine nope, how sure inconvenient didn't. travel was before I invented flu powder. 
Oh, those were cool, man. Those are so cool. Freaked me out for a second. I thought we had like a... Some kind of mad creature coming at us. Badass. I like it. Alright, so we got a little encampment or something I over must here. Have come this way. Think. It's calling our name. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. Ah. I've been busy with my research. This is awesome. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student! You can't be sick! <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupid! Uh -oh. That's right. Let's get it. Let's get it. Back here. Who do you want? Inside you. Toasted him. What? Oh, watch the light go What's out that? of your eyes. Ooh. That's kind of a boss character there. I'm not going anywhere with you. Let me Let Yeah. How'd you like that? What on earth just happened? I've never in been face. accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. Are you all right? It's all right, Nora. Oh, yeah. Thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seem more like quite Ash Wipers. On you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Okay. I thought that Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here oh, centuries cool. ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. He was a Slytherin, that's awesome. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it I in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Sweet is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of mallows. Let's try it out. It's just We're over there. there by my tent. Okay. This trunk. Yes, so shake plenty, pop this even open. if you already have some. I have the mallow sweet. Okay then. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the mallow sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. 
Is it really that easy? My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. Incendiary. I'm curious about these pyres. Revelio. Okay, so we gotta do something with them. Leviosa, incendio. The flames make the pyre sink. Yes. That's cool. What a day. I can hardly believe. Revelio. I take it we oh, can call cool. that a success? What do you make we of it, Nora? Indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. And do be careful out here. Now, I've Take got what easy, I needed. Nora. I shall return to the safety of my note. Revelio. Oh, look at her stuff pack up. That's so cool. Wait, you forgot something. Incendio. So we have to go all the way back and find the note in the courtyard now. Alright, well we're going to wait and make our way back to uh, Hogsfart. Hogwarts. Hogsfart. What's up, dude? Now this way to put your hood up, too. I don't know if this one has a hood. I learned that today too. Let's look at the gear real quick. We'll upgrade and all that, but from my understanding, yeah, this one doesn't have a hood. But if it did have a hood, let's see if one of them does. This one does, I think. So yeah, pop the hood on. Interesting, huh? Let's get back to it. Put that back. Yeah. All right, so we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode of Hogwarts Legacy. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Ball of Gathering Mushrooms. Thanks for joining me today. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications. I do these videos daily, and you can help join in on this adventure and see this could prove what dangerous comes next. Don't careful. forget to leave a like on the video. That's a huge help for me, and it is greatly appreciated. I'll see you all next time. Incendio! Peace. Damn it.